welcome Gemini's I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back um this week is the first week of August this week begins from um the third until the ninth okay so whatever is happening and transpiring this week is from the third until the ninth and we are going to be looking at the energies of what is happening and what is transpiring so i see a lot of you um could be working on some new projects some of you should have travel um but traveling comes out on um the um uh, some of you are having issues um, if you're traveling or um, if you're going to be traveling. I see traveling is coming out on um, the reverse form. So what is the message for you? Um, um, Gemini is dreams. It's the week of dream. It's the week of dreaming, bringing in reality what it is that you want, what, what it is that you want to acquire in your world. And whatever the issue and the situation is, is that I see that some of you are dreaming to go home or dreaming to be with your family or dreaming to reconnect to a family member. But I see a whole lot of problems, problems with um, your parents um, overseas that um, or problems with your parents in another city or in another state. So I see a lot of you uh, Gemini's are having some issues and I see you have a lot of work. Um, this week is a busy week, especially at, uh, at work, and um, you need to focus more on your work, and you're spending most of your time dreaming. Some of you are going to be finding out some real deceptive play with um, someone, some uh, someone in um, government institutes, the organization, some lies and deceptiveness from this person, and some disruptive behavior from people in government institutes and organization. And I see you're going to be um, realizing how horrible that not everyone that work in um, these organizations are really for the right uh, reason. So what are we seeing happening here is that some of you are dealing um, with uh, some issues, friendship. Um, some of you could be in a relationship with a fire sign person, whoever this fire sign person is. Um, it could be a mother. Some of you are really... Um, dreaming to go visit your mother if your mother is a fire sign person then i see a lot of information is coming is going to be coming in to you um gemini's from a pisces cancer scorpion um this is information that is coming in from a um scorpion man whoever this person is some of you you could have been in relationship or it could be a brother or a friend i see information is coming in from this man some of you, um, Gemini's, your burdens is going to be over and you're going to be making some decision about work or some decision about people and situation around you. Um, I see it's definitely about work or your business. I see a lot of you are trying to finish up a project in order um, to move forward and to release yourself from an issue and a situation. So we're going to be looking and seeing what exactly is transpiring um yes so there is some information and this is um someone who is a scorpion whoever the scorpion is it could be a sister or a brother um whoever um the scorpion is is having some issues with a fire sign person with a sagittarian woman so it could be your mom if your mom is a sagittarian or it could be a haunt or a family member but i see some form of uh, information um, that um, some of you are going to be finding out the collaboration between a Sagittarian woman and a Scorpion. So it could be a sister or brother or a, a someone on the work floor who tries to affect you in some form of a way. A whole lot of information is going to be coming in. And it could be good for you, Gemini's, because it's, good, it's information that is coming in that is going to be helping you to release, release a burden, a burden that you have been carrying and you're going to be resolving this person and burden and making a decision. Some of you who are married to a fire sign person and you have a child that is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, you're going to make a decision about this child. You're going to either decide um, to... Either you know let this child go on their own or figure figure out some form of a way um for this child you're going to be overcoming some of you are going to be definitely traveling 
um to see your friends um whatever is coming up and transpiring i see some of you are going to decide to go travel to see some friends and some of you are going to be wanting to reconnect with a past love um and some of you are going to be um and is dreaming in order to go and reconnect with a past love or um with a family member whoever this um person is um so i see a lot of you are going to be victoriously overcoming some sort of falls um friendship or issues that was created by your partner a cancer and a young taurus Virgo, or capricorn some of you are going to be finding out if you're in a relationship with a cancer um this cancer i've been also seeing a pisces a scorpio and this cancer um has worked together with their mother and their brother in order to create a lot of um deceptive world around you and their secrets is now out so it's as if some of you gemini was in a relationship with a cancer whoever this cancer is was very deceptive had a lot of secrets this cancer was also seen a taurus virgo or a capricorn person and they're finding out the truth about the deceptiveness so some of you gemini's was mary um to a fire sign person whoever this fire sign person is you're going to be finding out that this fire sign person was only in this relationship for money and this is a, a something and i advise a lot of people try to find out the reason why a person is with you for the first thing um before you get involved with these people because people are only looking for people that they can um financially support themselves off some of you you're going to be finding out that a friend or so is in the hospital and you're going to be going to visit this friend um a lot of you are going to be finding out that a cancer and a scorpion was always in love with each other okay so you could have been in a relationship with um let's say a cancer but they were always in love with a scorpion or you were in love with a scorpion but let's say they're always in love with a cancer some secrets is coming out about your um your um your partner and their uh, mother and their family and sisters and brother i see you're going to be turning your back on um a situation where you find out that you're moving forward and leaving a relationship behind you you realize that um i don't need to bring this in my future um this relationship this situation is now over and i see you're going to be explaining that some of you could be going um to uh, you're going to be victoriously overcoming a deceptive play a deceptive situation that was um transpired a lot of you are going to be receiving some good news is coming um to you and your husband or your wife because it is all the center is about your marriage so some of you you're realizing i see conflicts um secrets with a scorpion and a leo conflicts is here with a scorpion and a leo um this could be sisters or these could be people who were seeing each other so what we see here is number 77 some of you gemini's whatever is happening you're on the right part twice seven um some of you are in the right part with um um your work some of you are realizing that the burden that you have been carrying is going to be resolved so what we see here that is transpiring is that uh, um some of you who are dealing with a cancer you're going to be finding out uh, um, and if you're divorcing a cancer or if you're trying to figure out if you should divorce a Leo, um, whatever is transpiring, you are seeing here um, that you're going to be overcoming some horrible secrets that your partner kept uh, about a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn. This could have been your um, brother-in-law or your sister-in-law. This person was very deceptive. You're going to be finding out that this person and the cancer and their mother was in a cahoots and have a lot of secrets you're going to be finding out the lies and deceptiveness from your cancer mother and some real deceptiveness that this woman has done 
and they're going to be finding out the truth that this family has created a lot of criminal offenses somewhere before and um, you are like a target you were target okay so you Gemini's are going to be finding out that you were target um, and you're going to be finding out or horrible horrible your your um your partner and the sisters and brothers how horrible they are and you're going to be finding out this family secrets you're going to be just running see this is about running you're just going to be running leaving this marriage leaving this relationship you are just going to be running and letting it go you're like bye Woo! you people are too no, I, I no. So I see a lot of you Gemini's just leaving your partner because you're finding out some secrets about your partner. Um, and if you notice, this is your marriage partner. Um, it could be that some of you are married. I see you're going to be thinking about divorcing because you find out so much secrets about the mother, the brother, and you're finding out that this person was not your partner, brother, or sister, they were their lovers. Oh my God. Ooh, mix up. Mm -mm -mm. Gemini's, I have been explaining to you, Gemini's, that you cannot go with a water sign. You have to go with an earth sign or an air sign. All right? And I've then seen this because, you know, you somehow, you young people, whoever is caught up in this, is going to be really escaping a narrow escape because you had no idea who your your um your in-laws was this person was not her brother but our her um it was uh, um her lover <laughs> oh my god lies so I see some of you running away from your marriage partner and their in-laws. You're basically, you're definitely, there it is, you're running. Eight of ones, you are running with eight. And I see here, um, these are two eights together. So you have a double whammy. And what is transpiring is that with this double whammy, you have two double whammy. So um, and Gemini's, you're very, very lucky in this week because you have two double whammy. And whatever this false, um, false situation that you got yourself caught up with, with all the secrets about this, um, um, this person, um, you are going to be realizing that it's a good shot to get rid of them. <laughs> it's going to be, hmm, now is the good shot to get rid of them. So it could be that you, Gemini's, um, find out that you're, your husband or your son has gotten involved with this woman and they have secrets in the family. Oh my God, it is horrible. It was like, really? Um, and I see what is happening is that you are saying, let's go. This, we are not getting involved with this. We gotta get away from this. It has to do with a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of money. Okay, um, a whole lot of conflict, secrets, lies, and deceptiveness in the family about a whole lot of money. Truths are coming out, and I see a tower moment is finally coming in, and this tower moment is going to be ending and revealing a lot of deceptiveness that was going on. And I see you, um, Gemini's is going to be so happy, so happy that you got rid of this family or these family in-laws um but whatever has transpired they're going to be finding out uh, that whatever has transpired some of you a legal issue is going to be paying out big so if you gemini's were going through some form of a legal issue this legal issue is going to be really paying out big big time because they have seen some sort of a um fraud um, experience that has transpired so if you, Gemini's, was waiting out on the payout of um, a legal issue, it is a yes, it's going to be happening. What we see here is that some of you are um, turning away from your marriage, turning away from um, some legal issue. And um, if some of you were having car problem, I see that uh, you are going to be resolving this car problem. But it is more that uh, 
you're overcoming some false and lies and deceptiveness of a, of a cancer and the relationship they had with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and was saying that it was uh, their brother, but actually they were all long in a relationship with each other. Thank God this um, came out about your husband or wife. You could have got married to this person and this person was playing you all the time. Secrets about this young Taurus Virgo or Capricorns and all their secrets are coming out now. And I see you're turning your back and walking away walking away from the conflicts that some of you had been dealing with, with either this family member, whoever this family member is, you're overcoming and you're finding out the truth and you're releasing yourself and moving forward. Some of you who are in relationship with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn is going to be finding some secrets out that is going to create a whole lot of conflicts and it's about a whole lot of money. So be aware of that. A whole lot of you or just releasing yourself and moving away, um, either by divorce or saying to someone, um, I no longer want to be in this relationship or this situation. And I see you're definitely complete, com communi clearly, uh, communicating clearly that you no longer want to be in a situation. And I see you're going to be really victoriously overcoming. So there is good news, good news that is coming in, some of you, who are in love with a Scorpio. The Scorpio could be asking you to get married. Good news is coming in where I see whatever the issue and the situation is with the, um, the family and family money, there is a lot of conflicts. But I see this conflict is going to be over, okay? And whatever the issue is that you were having with a Libran or a legal suit, I see a whole lot of you are going to be winning and winning big. A project is now over. Some of you were working on a project a project is now over this um project could be ended and this project is going to be bringing a lot of uh, um financial stability in your world and then we see the energy of the seven of cups and whatever this energy of the seven of cups seven of cups is always bittersweet and there is a definitely a bittersweet with a scorpion whoever is dealing with a scorpion emotionally you are having some bittersweet moments with this scorpion because there is something that is not and this scorpion is really, and this scorpion could be someone you're in a partnership with, or it could be a family member, but there's a, there's a whole lot of bittersweet going on between you and this scorpion. If, whether it's your sister or your brother, um, the scorpion, you know, you're trying to work out an issue and a situation. It's not really happening um, because there is so much problem. So you could be dealing with your father, your parents are, um, and there is really some sort of a problem that is transpired. Some of you Geminis will have, because this came out in the reverse, will have some problems traveling um, because you got connected to some, some false deceptive people. That um, So some of you Geminis in this week might have some problems traveling. Um, whatever is transpiring, I see a tall moment that is coming in with something that has to do with in another city or overseas or traveling because um the boat is always traveling traveling overseas there is going to be some problems for some of you gemini's whether in the future because it's in a future position or it could be coming up in uh, this week at some time so some of you gemini's are really going to be having some problem with people um either um, people in power or business people or whatever um, when you're traveling in the future because of lies and deceptiveness um, that was created around you and you were connected to the wrong people um, in your world, okay? So, mm -mm -mm. gotta go. Namaste.